So let's talk about Afropop or what they call it now. Call you talked about You talked about grammar, bringing grammar. But sometimes mm. you're listening to some of these songs and it's just beats and talking about the same thing that revolves around women, drugs, mm. and the same kind of thing. Why is it? Did the things you guys sang those days yeah. is it not resonating in today's un, un, artists? Unfortunately, we're, this is a generation of crews. That's what they call it. So to them, so cruise they, is selling. They just, oh yeah, cruise is selling, you know. But they just want to cruise. They, they I call them the whatever generation because most times you're trying to tell them stuff seriously. The next last thing you hear is like, oh, whatever, Jerry, and they just go back to whatever they were doing, really. You know, so you can't. I don't blame them too much, but uh, at least I'm happy for people like myself, the two Baba, the Black Face, the African China, the Sun in Ages, the people who have evergreen songs but what they don't know that they're they're going to miss out on is the fact that you know and which is what is sad for me we're not going to have too many evergreen songs from this generation because mm. even right now most of most of the new songs don't last their lifespan is not more than three four five months say that again mm. we're not going Very to have what too many evergreen, evergreen songs, songs from this from generation, this generation.